mistake. Well, every three minutes, sometimes mistakes do happen. This might be one of them. Every three minutes, a utility line is damaged by digging, which cripples utility services that could lead to a disaster. Now, to be so careful, recently News 8 got a behind the scenes look at just how crews work quickly to repair leaks in such an emergency. So take a look at this city in Plano. In fact, it's not a real neighborhood, but one built as a training exercise for Atmos energy workers. They call it Gas City, and uh, we watched as these crews simulated what it would be like if there was a real gas leak from finding the problem to digging the backhoes and then repairing the gas pipes underground. And this is an example of the problem crews face when you start digging with no idea what's beneath. And so when the line is cut, we do have to respond as an emergency response, as an emergency order, which takes gas out of service, our customers are affected, our communities affected, and these employees have to get in an environment that we would rather not see. It's, so it's a damage prevention program that we're also teaching. They get to learn hands-on out here in the dirt uh, as, 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 as real life as you can get. The Dallas-based energy company is reminding homeowners and contractors to call before you dig. All you have to do is call 811. You can find out what utility lines are under your yard. This applies to anybody, especially right now, as people might be planting a tree, doing landscaping, putting in a fence, mm -hmm. any kind of that yard work. You start digging, you don't know what's there to cause yeah, a problem. You've got to be so careful. Yep. All right, let's get a check on.